What's up everybody, Crafty Chef Diamond, and welcome to my crafting kitchen. And what do I have today? I have finished my Disney castle. This is from Ever Moment. It's a 40 by 50. I started this on, let me get my little notes here. I started this on March 3rd. And I finished it on April 4th and I love it. It took me a while because guys look at the confetti in here. It's, it's just the confetti was everywhere. The only part I didn't have a lot of confetti was up in the sky. I have no complaints about this. This canvas is three years old and um, double sided adhesive. I had no bubbles, no rivers very little trash. Um, I had a lot of drills left over. Uh, the only, I do have one negative and maybe I can bring you in a little bit closer. And I think it's just because of the white. Let me zoom my camera in. You see a little bit of that. You can see the line going down here. Can you see the line right there? I have worked with a straightener and tried to straighten it. When you're working with double-sided adhesive, once you put that diamond down, it doesn't want to move. But I think it's because it was the, um, the white 3665, 3865. Yeah. So, um, I am really pleased with it. And this is, uh, let me bring it up so you can see a little bit more. I thought there was a lot of, I like the reflection of the castle. I just thought for the size of the canvas, I did get some pretty good detail on it, but I love it. It is definitely going into a frame. I hear now that Ever Moment from AliExpress has um, poured glue. I am excited to try one of their poured glue canvas, maybe another castle, but a little bit larger. But guys, I just wanted to get on here and share this with you, and uh, I'm really pleased with it. Uh, so go check out AliExpress. If I can, I'll try and put their link down below for you guys, okay? So you guys have a really good weekend. I'm getting ready to go to Mount Vernon tomorrow um, with a group of ladies from the church and we're all going to have lunch and we're going to go walk around George Washington's house. I am still working on Harry Potter, um, the pegboard. So, um, I'm halfway done. So part three will be coming pretty soon. I wanted to work on it this evening, but it's a little dark in my craft room. And if you put an overhead light on top of Mr. Potter, um, the light reflects off the plastic pegboard and so you just you can't really look at the colors but anyways um i just wanted to share this post review with you guys and have a great weekend and i will see you in my next video bye guys see you later